So you might be wondering, what does Dean do that other professionals um, don't do? Um, and I wondered that too. I thought, well, you know, this guy's just going to be the same as everybody else. You know, he's just got a better sales technique, perhaps. <coughs> Excuse me. So what I have figured out is that um, these exercises that Dean um, provides um, exercise the comfortable side, not the sore side. Whereas regular physio tell you to exercise that sore side, you know, work through it, you know, work through the pain. Um, you know, it'll free it up and all this, but it doesn't, it didn't do that for me. Um, and from what I can ascertain, I don't think it does it for other people either. Um, I often wonder with physiotherapists, the, the, the regular ones, do they ever find out why people stop coming? Is it because they've been successful or like me, didn't work? Um, so um, uh, with, with Dean, he's certainly got getting the results and I've seen the results in testimonials. Um, online and people writing in and, and, and the Facebook groups and things like that. I've seen his success rate too. And, and that makes sense to me to exercise the side that doesn't hurt. And I have seen the results for myself. I was skeptical at first. I thought, is this going to work? Not going to work. So that, that's the difference for me with Dean. It's exercising the comfortable, less restrictive side to have a, um, a therapeutic effect, a healing effect on the bad side. And it works. Yes, at first I was doubtful that seeing someone online without seeing them physically wouldn't work. I just thought someone's got to get me on a table and have a prod, see my scans, you know, understand what's going on for me and be with me to make sure I can do the exercises properly or whatever it is. Um, and then I thought, well, you know, that's never worked in the past. Maybe just maybe this, this will work. And what's the best thing about it is, it's empowering me to take full control of my own health. I am responsible for my health and for my healing. And that's what's good for me, because I can, I've sort of figured out that if this comes back, and I hope it won't, but if it comes back, I know what to do. For me, that's empowering because I mean, I've taken my health into my own hands, uh, with diet and exercise and, and now this, this is a great revelation. I love it. You've been in the program two weeks, maybe three weeks? Yes, yes that's right. The first consultation was three weeks ago, but that was the initial consultation. Yes. <coughs> and you started the program a couple of days after that? I did, but I, I had read the book first up, yes. And I was using uh, the three exercises from the book first, and that's what intrigued me. Um, to continue and improve. Okay. And so right now you're about three weeks in and if you were to grade yourself on a 100% scale of improvement, how much better are you feeling? Okay. Um, so far as the course is concerned, I would say I'm like 80% there. Really just from doing the exercises, I could have actually say, it's a hundred percent improvement on what I was, but I still know I've got the sciatica um, just from various movements during the day. But I'm not in anywhere near as much pain. I'm off all the medicate, the prescription drugs. I'm delighted, and this week I can walk longer distances. That's a breakthrough for me. Walking was very difficult. I can ride my bike as far as I can. You know, long, long long distances, but walking was problematic. Okay, so my symptoms initially started uh, in about the end of February this year, and it's now July. So I started with a, a simple movement. I just reached across my body to pick something up um, on the floor. No big deal, you do it all the time. And I felt an electric shock. Oh, and I thought, oh, that can't be good. But I kept on moving and it didn't seem to bother me, but it then it, and then it did. And it just got worse and worse and worse as the days went by. And I was ending up um, walking like a little old lady, bent, quite bent. And my husband said, stand up straight, stand up straight. And I said, 
you know, if I stood up straight, I couldn't walk at all. This is enabling me to walk. So I could walk then, but in a bent state, and I knew that wasn't right. So I did the usual things that most people do. Um, I saw physiotherapy. Um, they prodded and poked and um, did all kinds of things that hurt a lot and said I should do these particular exercises that hurt and consequently it hurt so much. I didn't do them, did I? Um, so then I came, we were on holiday. So we came back home after a couple of weeks and I went and got, I went to the doctor, got a prescription for a MRI and a scan and that showed that I've got a bulging disc in the lumbar spine. So more physiotherapy was recommended. And if that didn't work, my um, sports physician was going to recommend a injection into the spine, which I was a bit scared of really. Um, so I tried physiotherapy uh, more um, diligently because I didn't want that injection in the spine. Um, and then the physio I went to um, massaged my piriformis because it was very, very tight. And I nearly jumped off the table. I said, oh, that hurts, that hurts, don't do that. He saw, I have to do it, you know, I just got to massage, I just got to, just got to massage. Mm. Oh, it was awful. And, and he said, oh, it'll probably hurt more the next few days. It'll flare up, but that'll be good. It'll ease your movement long, long term. But you know what? It didn't. No. So I didn't go back, right? <laughs> uh, and then I, I do a lot of research on lots of health issues, and I found you. I found your Facebook group first, and then I saw that you'd written a book. And I thought, great, that suits me. I'll read the book. And I got it on Kindle and read it and thought, try the exercises. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. Um, it seemed to make a lot of sense to me because I didn't want it to hurt anymore. Um, didn't want to do any exercises that hurt. So I did them and I had great success just with those first three exercises. It enabled me to stand up straight initially. I could then stand up straight. My posture was m much improved. I knew I wasn't there, but I was prepared that it would take a while. So then I thought, oh, um, I'll contact Dean and have the consult. So I did, and the rest is history. The rest is nearly history. <laughs> Three weeks down the track from seeing you, I'm feeling a lot better, doing more exercises. So that's great. If you like what Joe had to say and you're sick and tired of not getting the results you deserve and need, please reach out to us today at info at sciatica relief now dot net.